One of the great things about watching classic movies, there's always something new to see. And today's feature is no exception. I'm Ted Rouse for Turner Classic Movies. We are in the West Virginia Penitentiary, which was used as the actual film location for one of the most intense and suspenseful noir classics ever made. And that is This movie marked the directorial debut by the great Charles Lawton, the prolific actor who starred in The Hunchback of Notre Dame. Night of the Hunter was to be Lawton's only directing effort because he was so disheartened by the reviews. Although, that may have been short-sighted because the film grew in popularity with the advent of television. Our movie features an amazing ensemble cast. Robert Mitchum gives one of the best performances of his career as the deceitful Beware of false prophets, which come to you in sheep's clothing. The deceitful con artist, along with Shelley Winters and silent movie legend Lillian Gish. The screenplay was partly written by Davis Grubb, who also authored the book on which the movie is based. It's likely the prison inspired Grubb, since it has such an ominous presence in this small town of Moundsville where he grew up. I could go on but I don't want to rat out the entire plot. That would be criminal. What he said, a 1955 United Artists release, Night of the Hunter. <laughs> 